We are discussing about gate 1996 EC paper. Look at the following sequence of instructions. If they are executed by 8085 microprocessor, what are the contents of stack pointer and HL register pair? So, out of four options, the right option is C. C is the right answer. We will see how this one. First, the program sequence is starting at 1000 memory location where the instruction is LXI SP, 27 FFH. This instruction will copy the contents 27 FF into 16 bit register SP. That is, this instruction loads 16 bit register SP with the contents specified in the instruction. So, stack pointer is now loaded with 27 FF. Assume this is a stack pointer and the value is 27 FF and the contents at this memory location are unknown we don't know the contents next call 1006 this is next instruction is call 1006 it's a 3 byte instruction as previous LXISP is also 3 byte instruction call 1006 is an unconditional call instruction so when this instruction is executed the program sequence is transferred to the address specified in the instruction and just before this transfer the address of next instruction to call will be pushed onto the stack because whenever you are using a call it will go into a, some subroutine and it has to come back to its calling program so it must find some write instruction okay so whenever it is coming back it must know what is the next instruction it has to execute for that purpose, the next instruction to the call is going to be placed in stack. The instruction, the next instruction to the call instruction is nothing but the present address of program counter. The present address of program counter is loaded into stack and the program counter is loaded with the new, new address which is specified in the call instruction. Okay. Now we will see. This is address of next instruction. Since call is a 3 byte instruction, address of next instruction is 1006 okay this will be loaded into stack so stack pointer first decremented for push operation so it will become 2 ffe then higher order is going to be placed 10 next again the stack pointer is decremented 2 ffd and lower order 8 bits are placed Okay. Now the program counter is loaded with the address specified in the call instruction. Unfortunately, in this program, the next address it is going to be is same as the ne uh, next instruction address. So program counter again it is loaded with 1006. Okay. Now the program is going to be starts from this address location where we have pop h. Pop h means popping the contents from the stack and are loaded into HL register pair that is top of the stack contents are going to be loaded into HL register pair so the sequence is going to be looks like this first okay now the stack pointer is addressing it to FFD so the contents from this memory location are loaded into lower order register that means L so it will be removed now the stack pointer is decrement incremented by 1 so, the stack pointer is going to be at 2 FFE and the contents of stack pointer is loaded into higher order register H and these contents are removed and the stack pointer is incremented by 1. Now, the present stack pointer is pointing at 2 F, 2 7 FF. Okay. HL register pair contents are going to be 1006 and stack pointer is present at 2 7 FF. So, this is the right answer. SP is equal to 2FFF and HLR 1006. Stack pointer and HL register contents. So, the right option for this one is C. Thank you.